it definitely helps to be along 94 because yes. you can please each person. You can go to Chicago, you can come to Milwaukee, Minneapolis. So it's really in a good spot, depending on hopefully where they will tell us they will leave. But we do know that we have a number of people who are actually in southeastern Wisconsin who are waiting and watching to hear this announcement. We want to flip it over to Brandon Rook to give us more from there. Hey, Brandon. A Shannon and Katie, this is big for Racine County. As you can imagine, the manufacturing jobs coming to this area will be a huge impact on the area. Over the last 30 years, they've lost lots of manufacturing jobs, and it's kind of a rebuild right now. And I have with me Senator Van Wangard and Sir. That was really good. <laughs> Thank you. Talk about this huge impact on what this means for the area. Well, this is really exciting. When you have a company that's willing to locate in southeastern Wisconsin that is coming from uh, Asia to be here and open up the first LCD manufacturing complex anywhere in the United States, that is absolutely awesome. We are just totally giddy and excited about this opportunity. This is over 10,000 jobs. Uh, it is going to be jobs that are going to be entry-level jobs, and I think the majority of them are going to be uh, family supporting jobs and then above that other uh, additional uh, skilled jobs. So this is really going to be uh, an exciting change for our whole uh, area in southeastern Wisconsin. Just talk about, you talk about the jobs that Foxconn is bringing. Talk about the jobs outside, the surrounding jobs, the construction jobs, the build around the Foxconn uh, plant that, that's coming. Well obviously this is going to be a huge plant. Uh, it's going to be over a thousand acres the complex is going to be, be built on so that was one of the criteria we have that right close to the interstate uh, and i'm hoping that it's going to be located right here in mount pleasant sturdivant area because uh, i think that offers that potential uh, for the size and their needs for access etc but we're going to be looking at several thousand jobs just for construction uh, which is going to boost the area and that's just for the manufacturing part of this for their campus we're also going to have thousands of people that are going to look at moving to our communities. And in Caledonia, Mount Pleasant, Raymond, all these communities that are close, I think you're going to see a lot of construction jobs for, for home construction too. So this is going to be really exciting for us locally. Thanks, Senator. And Shannon and Katie, as you can see, people are here waiting to watch the announcement that's coming up shortly. And of course, we're going to be staying out here and we'll keep you guys updated with the latest. And we'll have their reaction right after that announcement is made. Back to you guys in the studio. All right, Brandon. Thank you. If you want to follow this continuing story, we have coverage on our website at TMJ4. Look for Foxconn comes to Wisconsin.